Hello everyone and welcome to the Siberian Husky Academy. Dominic Ferrero here to talk about the following subject, how to greet your Siberian Husky puppy in his new home. Let's discuss the important items to have and how to prepare your home. It is important to decide in advance if your puppy will live inside your house or outside. This will determine the equipment that you will absolutely need to have. My advice for you is to opt for your puppy living inside your home. Let's keep in mind that Huskies are pack dogs. If you do not have another dog, yourself and your family will become his pack. Your Husky will quickly find its balance in your group of individuals, so needless to say, he prefers to live and to be as close to you as possible. Make sure to have all the essentials in order to greet your Husky puppy without having to run to the store several times in the first few days. Here are the objects that you will need when preparing for the arrival of your dog. Good quality food and treats, ideally the ones recommended by the breeder, metallic stainless steel bowls, a nice collar and a medallion with his name and your telephone number engraved on it, brushes and combs that are specific to his fur type, grooming products such as puppy shampoo and ear cleaning products, toys adapted for puppies to keep him amused and busy while you are away, and lastly, it is highly recommended to have a small bed for your dog. However, some people prefer to have a crate. He likes to explore, to test his master, to get into trouble, and to take risks that could jeopardize his health or that could be worrisome to you. Make sure you cover all electric wires and plugs, that all small objects that can be easily comestible are hidden away because a puppy can choke on them, and that all poisonous products are safely locked away. Also, before becoming the perfect adult dog, your puppy can venture into forbidden areas of the house. It is important to define the spaces in your house where your dog will be allowed to go beforehand. Educating and supervising your puppy will be done in a more efficient way if this is thought out in advance. For this aspect, room dividers used with kids are a good ally. I also recommend using repulsive sprays on all corners of your furniture in order to keep your puppy from biting them. In the end, it's up to you to choose what is best for your puppy. Now that you have all the basic essentials, it is time to prepare your home for the arrival of your puppy. Keep in mind that well-brought-up adult dogs were once puppies also. In some respects, the behavior of a puppy is similar to the one of a child.